Hey guys, Jeff the Nasia guy here at Zoo Montana. We're at the front desk gift shop behind me here and I want to show you this little critter that's hanging out in our front desk lately, hermit crab. Pretty cool little animals. And these guys are actually native, really down south, the Caribbean, Florida, you can find on the Virgin Islands have them. And what makes them a hermit crab is they're just that, they're hermits. So they like to find a shell and what they'll do is they'll find, they'll get in that shell and they have a really soft body, which is weird because their claws are so hard, but their body is soft and curved. So it works really well on a shell like this. So they kind of tuck themselves back there. And if you look in there, believe it or not, he's in there right now. You can see his claws. This is actually what we call a purple pincher, which are a native down in the Caribbean. And what's amazing is that they will find a shell, but as they grow, their shell doesn't grow with them. So they have to go out and find new shells as they grow. In fact, I've even seen hermit crabs adapt to weird things, including some people have them and have made Lego shells for them. So a hermit crab carrying around a big thing of Legos is a shell. I mean, these guys are pretty adaptive little critters. And what these guys do is they'll eat really anything they come across, things like fallen fruit and uh, maybe some seeds and things like that. And now, get this, there's 1,100 species of hermit crabs in the world, the biggest of which is the size of a coconut. Imagine that. That's a big big hermit crab. And uh, an animal like that, I mean, they, believe it or not, they've been known to live upwards of 12 to 70 years. Now, something like this, if treated well, can actually go 20 years, but normally they only live maybe a year if that. But if you care for them well and you take good, good care of them, they're uh, pretty amazing. Now, what I love about this guy is that he's starting to eventually come out. You'll see him come out, use that claw, of course, and these pedipales that he can actually use. Uh, and big giant eyes that kind of stick out. Just a cool, weird looking critter. And if you see them in the wild, they're pretty amazing to see out there. They're usually around salt water and they're semi-aquatic. Some species are terrestrial, meaning they spend their whole life on land except for when they're born. And so there's different, def definitely different species that have different behaviors out and about. But if you do want to see this guy come up close, come on out, check him out. He's here at the front desk. They'd be happy to show him to you. You can watch him and see how cool these guys really are. So something unique, something different, we thought it'd be fun to have right here at the front desk for you. So until next time, I'm Jeff the Nature Guy here at Zoo Montana. We'll see you at the zoo.